Carrie, uh, I agree. Uh, it's not acceptable that uh, anyone has been struck down in the streets of Boston and killed on their bicycle. It's not acceptable that they've been college students either. Uh, in the immediate aftermath of the most recent Commonwealth Avenue uh, death that occurred, I walked the street with some engineers and some uh, bicycle advocates to figure out how we can make those areas safer. But we can't wait to determine what intersections are dangerous based on someone being injured or even killed. We have to get together ahead of time and identify, as we all well know, the problem intersections that presently exist and make them safe today. We also need to provide education to area college students who are coming here, really in some cases totally unfamiliar with the roadway systems, and we need to provide education to all riders in general. Uh, I think some of those are immediate steps that we can get started on right away. Uh, I also think that we can't stop with bicycles. We need to have a U-Pass program for public transportation where every single college student has access to a T-Pass and that that T-Pass is something that will, that U-Pass program will add millions of dollars to our public transit and, you know, creating a stronger system of alternatives to, bicycle, to, to automobiles is really what we want to do. Uh, and so that will bring greater investment into public transportation. And if we continue to focus on bicycles and public transportation instead of just cars, uh, I think we'll continue to make Boston safer.